hello or welcome so today we will see form parsing with document ai so we are using python language here so we will start the lab it will automatically enter the username click on next enter the password click on next So our lab will initialize so let's see the overview so what is document ai so document ai is a document understanding solution that takes unstructured data example documents email invoices and form and makes the data easier to understand analyze and consume so the api provides structure to con contain classification entity extraction and advanced searching and more so in this lab uh, we will learn how to use document ai from parser to parse a handwritten form with python so we will use a simple medical intake form as an example but this procedure will work with any generalized form supported by doc ai okay so now let's see the objective so in this lab we will learn how to perform the following task so first extract data from a scan uh, form using the document ai form parser then extract key value pairs from a form using a document ai form parser then extract and export csv data from a form using the document ai form parser okay so we have already uh, set up our lab okay so now we will activate the cloud shell so here it's the cloud shell okay so now we will execute this command click on authorize now execute this command so it's done now first task is we will enable the document ai api so before we begin using document ai uh, we must need to enable the api okay so for this um, we, we need to click on the uh, active cloud shell that we already done and we need to execute this command to enable the api okay so we okay so now our in api is enabled So now uh, we will install pandas and so pandas is an open source data an analysis library for python okay so for this uh, we need to execute this command okay it's done now we will run the following command to install the python client libraries for document ai okay so now we are ready to use document ai api okay now we will check our progress okay awesome it's completed now task second is create a form parser processor so uh, we must need to first create a form parser processor instance to use in the document ai platform for this tutorial okay so uh, we need to navigate to uh, document ai okay so we will search this Okay, so this is our document AI.
so now we will click on explorer processor and inside from processor uh, we will click on create uh, processor okay and here we will cl click on create processor okay so we will give it name as lab from processor parser okay okay and uh, we will select the closest region on the list okay so european united state so it will choose uh, united state only okay now we will click on create so processor is created successfully now we will copy the processor id okay so that we will use it uh, in later in the lab okay so this is our id i will save this in the notepad okay now we will check the So now we will test the processor in the cloud console. So we can test our processor in the console by uploading a document. Okay. So we will right click the image below and select save image as to download the sample form. Okay. So this is the sample form that we are going to download. So this is the sample form. We will save it here. So now on the processor details page we will click on upload test document and select the form uh, we just downloaded okay. So here is the upload test document okay and uh, uh, the file type that are supported are jpg, jpg, png, bmp, pdf, tif, tif and gif and the uh, pages will be it uh, it will accept 15 pages and up to the size of 20 mb max okay okay so we will upload this document it's analyzing the document okay so see it's uh, highlighted the content okay and it's giving the date means what are the field here okay So now our third task is we will download the sample form okay so in this section we will download a sample document uh, which contain a sam simple medical intake form okay so we will run the following command to download the sample form uh, to our cloud shell okay So form is downloaded now we will confirm the file is downloaded to our cloud shell using the below command okay so we will ls it ls intake form dot pdf okay so this form is available now the fourth task is extract from uh, key value pairs okay so now uh, we will use the online processing api to call the form parser processor uh, we created previously and then we will use extract the key value pairs found in the document okay so online processing is for sending a single document and waiting for the response and uh, we can also use batch processing uh, so if you want to send multiple files or uh, if the file size exceeds the online processing maximum pages so the code for making a process request is identical for every processor type aside from the processor id so the document uh, response object contain a list of pages uh, 
uh, from the input document and each page object contain a list of the form field and their location in the text okay so the following code iterates to each page and extract uh, each uh, key value and uh, confidence score so this is structured data uh, that can more easily store in database or use in other application okay so now uh, in the cloud shell we will create a file called from processor.py and we will uh, uh, paste the following code into it okay so let me create this file so i am using nano command okay this is our file so let me enter this content so we have uh, created the file and entered the code there now we will uh, see the next step so next step is we need to replace the project id uh, project location and the processor id and the file path okay so uh, first we will replace the project id so this is our project id now we will uh, give the project location so our location is us okay uh, now processor id from from parser id here we will replace the file path okay so we need to replace the file path so our file is same okay so all the changes are done now we will save our file okay so control x y enter our file is saved now we will run the following command to execute the script okay okay so we receive the uh, output as this okay so let's see So yeah, we receive the output. Now task five is the uh, we will pass the tables. Okay, so the form parser is also able to extract data from tables within documents. So in this section, we will download a new sample document and extract data uh, from the table. Uh, since uh, we are loading the data into pandas this data can be uh, can be output to a csv file and may other format with a uh, single method call okay so now we will download the sample form with tables okay so we will run the following command to download the uh, sample form okay it's downloaded now we will confirm if this form is available or not okay so this uh, form is available now we will extract the uh, table data okay so the processing request for table data is exactly the same as for extracting key value pair okay so the difference is which field you extract the data from in the response so the tab table data store in the pages uh, dot tables field okay so uh, this example extract information about from the table header rows and body rows 
for each table and page and then prints out the table and saves the table as a csv file okay so now we will create a file called table parsing.py and we will enter the following code into it okay so nano file is created now we will enter this code okay code is entered now let's see if any value we need to change okay so here also we need to change the project id project location to processor id and file path okay so let me check okay so here we need to change okay so from here we will get the id now uh, our project location so project location will be us uh, and form parser id so this is our id now uh, the file path so this is the same um, file path uh, let me confirm from this table yeah this is the same same one okay so now i will save control x y enter it's done now we will execute the script okay okay so output is here yeah the same output we received okay let me show you now we will run the following command to list the files in in our current working directory okay okay so these are all the file congratulations so we have completed this lab and in this lab we have successfully used the document ai api to extract data from a handwritten form and we have also learned how to use the document ai python client library to extract key value pairs uh, from a form and how to extract tabular data uh, from a form with tables okay so thank you for watching and if you like this video so please click on the like button and if you have any question any suggestion so please put down your comments in the comment section and if you are new to the channel so please subscribe and share this channel with your friends and colleagues so thank you have a great day